Let's do a bit more sound. Uh, let me just do this. R Actually, you know, let's let's just let's just. I I really enjoyed this, and and this was you know there were so many people. Obviously, like Sarah Silverman and Mark Marin and Andy Richter and Anil Dash, and I mean, it just ran. I I, I it's like one of those things that I don't want to list because it was just sort of an endless amount of people. Uh, but I did, I, you know, I always have a fun time when I go out to LA and I do the Young Turks and, you know, I, I know not all of these people, but I know, you know, Ben, uh, uh, pretty well. And I know Jank a little bit and, uh, I really enjoyed, you know, the way Jank, uh, showed up on this and, uh, appreciate it. So let's just take a little segment, a, a snippet here of Jank Uger. Uh, this was a couple days ago of his response to the, uh, the Sam Cedar situation. Okay, now, as you see there, he's a former MSNBC contributor because they, in essence, have fired him. So what are we going to do at the TYT network? Sam Cedar, you are not fired. <laughs> Get out of here, man. Are you kidding me? This is an attack by the alt-right by an absolute, let me care, be careful with my adjectives here, <laughs> a bad actor to say the least, as you're about to see. Yeah, I, I really just want to co-sign on that. Be careful with the adjectives thing. I think about that every day. <laughs> and we have to talk about this jackass. Uh, and then Jank did actually a brilliant job. Uh, it was a good 13-minute uh, segment. Yeah, it really good 13-segment. It was very satisfying and almost surreal to watch him speak about something so personal to us. Uh, yeah, and do show. it so well. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I really felt, classic, you know, Classic him mode. Like. Yeah, classic Jank mode. And I, I, I remember we you know, follow each other on Twitter, and I was like, you know, thanks, brother. And uh, and he retweeted it and everything. It was a it was a nice moment of of camaraderie, and I appreciated that and wanted to thank him for it. Um, now let's. Oh, we have Gutfeld. Oh yeah. Oh Greg, I don't know if you have those. We didn't pull these, but uh, Greg Gutfeld uh, tweeted out, and I think even Ben Shapiro retweeted uh, something to the effect of like Sam Cedar is an insufferable leftist who hates my guts, and. Uh, and uh, but you know MSNBC should apologize and reinstate him. And I quote tweeted it and I said, "We hate you back, and thank you." <laughs> Which I realized, and, and I remember one very literal-minded uh, Twitter person was like, "He did not say that he hated you. He said that Sam Cedar hated him. You're a journalist who cannot read." <laughs> Which was a good reminder of why nerds are terrible. Uh, this is uh, Greg Gutfeld's uh, tweet. I mean, but it really, this was, I mean, honestly, even, even this, like there was something heartening about at least some, some mass act of like people reminding each other that they could read, <laughs> you know, like that, that was uh, good to see. Hi folks, Sam Cedar here. We still need your help on our Patreon page. YouTube ads have come back, but not nearly as much as we had before. So if you can help us out, any little bit helps. Head over to our Patreon page right at this URL, and you'll help us keep helping you by making videos.